morning everyone, John for Popeye's Postcards. Uh, I know it's Saturday, but I'm still going to do a What Sold video today. These are the cards that sold on February 4th. And then Monday's video will be the cards that sold Saturday and Sunday. So let's go ahead and get started. As you can see on the screen, 30 orders on eBay for $2.92. I had one order on HIP for $9.99. So 31 orders for 302 on Friday. It's a really good day. First up, this is Home Lines SS Atlantic uh, Steamer Ship, and it sold for $25.99. Got this in the ship lot uh, probably a year plus ago, two years ago, for about 70 cents a card. Next is a promotional postcard, 1992 Score, Joe DiMaggio cards. So uh, Score is a like a baseball card um, company, and this was an advertisement for Joe DiMaggio. Sold for $8.99. Morris Katz, Jewish Judaica artist, signed in prayer. Actually, it's signed. And then in prayer. So his signature is right there. There's the back. There's his signature. $6.99 for that card. And same buyer bought this one. This is uh, Lifting the Torah. And it also went $6.99. These are going overseas. I don't remember exactly where. Next, Watch Hill, uh, Rhode Island. This is where T Swizzle lives now, I think. Uh, what's her name? Taylor Swift. Duh. Uh, this is the Life Saving Station and Crew, circa 1914. Sold for fourteen dollars. Next, Flint, Michigan. View of Flint River pre 1907, published by S. B. Clark. Sold for five ninety nine. I'm not going to go over there. Um, I have a couple other cards that sold yesterday. I'm not going to go over those. Uh, $5.99 for this one, just for interest of time. Shipboard ceremony, ritual crossing the equator, uh, question mark. Costumes, 1920. It has the look of a crossing the equator type of ceremony. I went through that when my ship crossed the equator on the way to Australia. Very interesting ceremony the Navy has. Um, this doesn't look like a warship, though. This looks like a passenger ship, and I'm not 100% sure if they did crossing the equator for passenger ships. They may have. I'm just not sure. Uh, $12. I'll deal with that offer later. I uh, probably paid $0.30 cents for that card. Uh, $12. Bibinji, Bibinji, uh, Minnesota. Birchmont Beach Hotel has been up for quite a while. And took a best offer of $4. Next, put in Bay, Ohio on Lake Erie, South Bass Island, Island Airplane, Airlines Plane. There's that one. This did not come in the airplane lot. I've had this one listed for a while. $8 on a best offer. Another one of those, um, actually this is the, uh, the doctor giving a sailor a shot. Uh, buyer contacted me, wanted all that I had left, which I was only four, and I gave him an offer of $2 per card. So for $8, he's taking them. He said he's going to try to resell them for $15 and work in the uh, shot and about the vaccine and current state of the world. So good luck. Hope he gets it. But... I could, these were pennies into this card, and I got $8 for four of them. This is artist sign Charles Russell watching the horse herd, 1950s. There's Charles Russell's signature. There are older ones uh, into the teens that are more valuable. These are chrome, I guess, reproduction or reprints. $4.99 for that card. I think I paid a dime maybe for that one. Chestertown, Maryland. Chester River. Bridge by Moonlight, circa 1920s. 
There's that. And sold for $14.99. Wheeling, West Virginia. State man, state map, man, Wheeling, West Virginia. There's that. And sold for $6.99. Next, Perth Amboy, New Jersey. View of homes along the bluff, 1909 view. There's that. Uh, 1224. Next, Las Vegas, Nevada, Tropicana Hotel Casino at night. This is a continental size. Also got this in the auction in August of 2021. Pennies for it, and I have multiple quantities at 249 for that card. Patriotic, Abraham Lincoln, Portrait, Eagle Flag, 16th President. It has some condition issues. And that's sold for $7.99. Next, El Paso Recreation Hall Camp Grande. Or Camp Grand. I think it's Grande. Grande. And that's sold for $4.99. This is Jackson, Tennessee. Crenshaw's Cottage Court Motel, circa 1940s. Nice linen roadside hotel. Our motel, six ninety nine. Ashtabula, Ohio, Pennsylvania Lake Front Docks Coal uh, Coal Rail Cars, nineteen oh eight. And that sold for nine seventy four. Long Island's uh, New York. This is Huntington Glen's Inn Restaurant Multi View. Eight ninety nine for that card. This is uh, Cats, Kittens, Basket, Watching the Shadows Play, 1905, Real Photo, and this is a Rotograph. I pick these up all the time. They're usually in the quarter or dollar box, and I always get $10 to uh, $14 for. This one came from the, the antique mall dealer who uh, his family was liquid liquidating his stuff because he passed away. I paid $0.30 cents for that and got $10.99. Valentine's Day, Cupid's Cherubs, Flowers, and Hearts, 1910, $9.99. It's a shame, this scratch, this is a beautiful card, but this scratch right here really, really detracts. It probably could be a $19 card. Uh, unfortunate scratch on Middle Heart. Yeah, that's a nice, nice card, $9.99. Car dealer, advertising, 1954 Buick 52 Super. Riviera Sedan uh, four door red. And ten fifty four for that card. Uh, this is one I've always butchered. Always, always, always. Lake. It's either Hopachong, Hopakong, or Hopakong. This lake in New Jersey that I can't pronounce. The fountain at the lake I can't pronounce. Vintage linen. And six ninety nine for that card. Valentine's uh, to my Valentine Cupid hearts embossed, probably airbrushed. And three ninety nine for that card. Uh, a little bit of paper loss. That's why I listed that one low. Another Valentine's Day B. Get it? My honey cannot bear uh -huh, to lose you. Uh, Outcult, I, I never been able to pronounce his name, but he's the one who did um, uh, Buster Brown, I believe. And I think the the Yellow Kid was one of his also. And four ninety nine for that card, and sold one card over on Hip. This is Worthington, Ohio, Green Hill Farm Cabin, circa nineteen forties, and that sold for nine. 99. So overall, a great day on Friday, over $300 in postcard sales. Um, I did sell uh, one uh, airline item so far. I have a couple listed in another store, which I'll go over in a future video. Okay, that's it. Hope your weekend is great and you have terrific sales. And I will see you Monday with a daily what sold. There won't be a video tomorrow unless something magical pops up. So have a good day.